Hi, my name is Karen Jones, uh, Content Editor for the Society of Technical Analysts. So we're looking at the S&P again because we have now broken below our channel, our first channel here. Now we talked about this when we were up here at the, the top of these two channels and we were talking about it failing. Uh, if it breaks, it, it fails at the top of a channel, the tendency is that you go to the bottom of the channel. So didn't hold the first channel, chances are we're going to the bottom of the second channel. Now that is nearer to 41.50. Your 200-day moving average, this blue line here, uh, comes in just below there at 41.27. That's where I think it's going. The RSI is low. It's not currently low enough to suggest oversold. So for now, it continues to look pretty weak to me. Good luck.